So Celosia Prestige Red. Um, you know, every year I have like my favorite plant that we uh, we offer, and um, this is this is a great plant. I love this plant, and I really want to encourage everybody to to uh, to order some and give them a try. And here's a couple reasons why I love this plant. It grows about uh, about this tall. I don't know what that's 24 inches or so. Um, and it gets just about this wide. It has really thick stems. It's a real sturdy plant. Um, the leaves are like this shiny, glossy, really thick leaf that uh, just makes a great contrast or background to the really the most bizarre blooms you'll ever see. Um, as you can see, these, you know, some, some people think they look like little brains, and I, I think they really do too. But uh, it's a cool, cool, very unique plant that um, fits in in a lot of different places in your garden. Um, it it um, matches well with other plants that we have in the catalog. Um, it's a great container plant, and um, it's a full sun plant too. I think I didn't mention that, but um, I what what I like about this plant too is you can plant it in the spring, you know, and and it'll just continue to grow, continue to grow. It doesn't get messy. It uh, it just keeps getting larger and larger, and then. You notice, like, at the end of the season, it still looks great, and um, and it's there until that first hard frost really hits it and knocks it back. It's an annual, but it's a great plant, and um, I use them in containers. I plant them in the ground, and they're so carefree that I really want everybody to give these uh, Prestige Celosia Red a try this year. It's an older plant been in the market for a long time. It's it's won a gazillion awards in the horticulture world and I think there are really some good reasons for that. Um, also feed them, you know, again if you feed your kids, if you feed your pets, feed your plants because they're living and they need to feed. I would feed, um, if you've got them in the garden, I'd use Nature Source Fertilizer which is in the catalog. Feed them once a week. If you're putting them in a container a couple times a week, will be perfect. So a couple plants in the catalog that you can uh, mix or plant together with the uh, Celosia Prestige Red would be um, the Dragon Heart uh, Full Sun Coleus. Really looks good. Um, I would plant the Celosias in front of that because they're going to be a little shorter than the Coleus. Um, they're um, also the Durango Marigold Mix is a really nice plant. That goes, plants that in front of the Celosia. So we also have a, uh, a perennial in the catalog. It's called a White Lion Shasta Daisy. And um, it, it can be planted side by side or slightly in the front of the Prestige, but that sort of that red, white, and yellow uh, contrast that you get from those two plants really works out very nice.